pursuing the potential of the sea, probing unfathomable fathoms. It's Illuminat. Illuminat, the world's first aluminum submarine. J. Lewis Reynolds, head of the Reynolds Metals Company, had an idea. Expand human existence under the sea through free enterprise. Underwater fish farms, subsurface electric dams, intercontinental submarine transportation, mineral extraction, and even subsea vacations. To accomplish all of this, Reynolds needed a deep diving submarine, and not one existed at the time. Reynolds would take a bold step and make his new submarine out of aluminum. One-third the weight of steel, aluminum had a greater strength-to-weight ratio than any other metal of the time. As a result, Illuminat's hull was constructed thick enough to withstand the colossal pressures of the deep sea, while simultaneously remaining light enough to float without supplemental buoyancy. With a crew of three or four scientists and engineers, Illuminat probed new frontiers of oceanographic and marine research and became the first submarine of any kind to dive to 15,000 feet below the ocean's surface. In 1969, using its external articulating arms, Illuminat helped recover a top-secret thermonuclear bomb lost at the bottom of the Mediterranean Sea. It later rescued Navy deep-sea submersible Alvin after it sank nearly a mile underwater. A product of clever innovation and the pursuit for human advancement, Illuminat was the forerunner of an entirely new generation of depth-probing vehicles. Retired in 1970, Illuminat is now stationed at the Science Museum of Virginia, where it's carrying out its new mission to inspire the world's future innovators.